What's up guys, it's Dr. Meatballs and I'm back with episode 15 of my Pixelmon. Let's play, I believe. Yeah, 15. And so, uh, then we're going to be doing some stuff, but I just want to say a couple things first. So, if you've seen my earlier videos, I don't know if you have, like, your new subscriber or anything. And if you are, welcome. But, uh, on the server, I am a gym leader. Um, but recently I have decided that... I no longer want to be a gym leader, and I'll tell you guys in a second, but yeah, I'm I'm back to just regular old player now, I'm no longer a gym leader, and I was talking with the, the head of gyms, that he did not force me on anyway, so don't get angry with him if you feel that way, it was all my decision, but so one of the reasons why I decided to resign was because, so I'm recording this at like 8, 8 o'clock at night right now. And I get home from school about 4 o'clock, and already so far today, I've put in about 3 hours and 15 minutes as, uh, at the gym, and like I'm like after I've already been demoted and stuff, back to regular like, player, and I was told that I would, oh, eh, I can't talk, I was told that I would only need to be uh, able to do 2 hours of battling per day and uh, so I did three hours and 15 minutes so far today and uh, I was asked to do more and I just I can't deal with like three plus hours of doing gym battles when I'm trying to record the when I'm trying to like do videos for YouTube when I just want to relax on here family friends school sleep just everything I can't I can't like deal with all that uh, at like one time, it's just it's too much. So I decided to resign. It was a hard decision, but yeah, I decided to. So no more gym battling episodes. Sorry if you like those, but I'll try and find like find something that I can do to substitute for that. So I'm sorry if you are angry with me about resigning, but yeah. So sorry if I sound a little bit like less enthusiastic. I have a really bad migraine right now, but I need to record this for you guys. So I uh, I apologize if I sound less enthusiastic or if this is a shorter video video, but yeah, that's why. So today uh, we're gonna be catching our next Pokemon. Last time I said that I was gonna be using Magnemite, but then I figured out something that I wanted to use more, and I actually did trade for Magnemite gave the guy five five thousand dollars which is like really overpriced to begin with and I'm not even gonna use them which sucks but I don't really care so today we're gonna be catching our uh, fifth member to our team which is going to be a Joltik and Joltik is a bug electric type when uh, I think he I don't know is he like I don't know, yeah I think he's bug electric type from the very beginning I don't know if he gets or he starts with one of them and then gets the other when he evolves, but I'm pretty sure he starts with both of them. But yeah, he is a really good uh, Pokemon, he's very underrated, and he has pretty good attack and amazing speed, so that's mainly the reason why I want to use him, just because I have a slower team right now overall besides, like, Starmie. So, yeah, I'm going to be looking for one, and they use... I, oh, no, I don't want... I don't want to fight you. And now I don't even have the ability to do slash end battle which is probably what I'm gonna miss most of from being a gym leader but whatever it's fine so anyway yeah he spawns at night and he spawns in forests and jungles so I think he only spawns at night I know, that's what somebody told me and I've only seen him at night so far but yeah so I'm gonna be looking around for him and if it turns the day before I find one then I'll probably just cut and then come back when it's night again, but I don't know. Or I'll just trade for one. I don't. I don't really know. I'll figure something out. But yeah, so let's just let's just look for one. Let's just look for one for a couple minutes because I think it's gonna. Is the moon going down or up? Okay, it's going down. So it's gonna be day in a couple, more than like 30 seconds anyway. Return day. Not it, yeah, whatever. You know what I mean. But so anyway, yeah. Let's just look for one for a little. Okay, it's already turning day. That's no good. Uh, let's see if we can find one like right off the end of the night spawns, just because like a lot of them linger through the beginning of the day if they don't like despawn or anything. 
But I don't see anything spawning right now, except for that drift balloon, but I killed him. So, that's the only thing I really saw spawning. And sorry if you can uh, hear me sniffling, I'm still sick. So, I apologize for that. Yeah, I just sniffled there in case you didn't hear it. But I'm, pr I'm pretty sure you did, because I'm a very loud sniffler. I sound like an animal, like a wild animal of some kind. I don't know what kind of sounds like that, but yeah, something like that. So, I can't find one, so I'm probably going to just cut away here and then ask for, or ask if anybody has one in the moment to trade. So, I'll be back in a second, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I got a Joltik. He's level 23, and also, he is Pygmy. Look how small he is. He's so tiny, you can barely even see him. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's awesome. Uh, so let's just check out his stats and stuff. So, Naive Nature, Pygmy, yeah. Speed, 43. Defense, 28. Special Attack, 34. Defense, 33. Yeah, yep, yeah, okay. That's decent stats, decent stats. So, yeah, we're gonna be leveling up with him a little bit today because we obviously gotta get him ready for the flying gym. So, let's do slash travel and let's head over to Obscuro. Actually, let's check what movie I have. I can do that. Electro web. Wow, that's a weird move. That's like, I think that's like only only he can learn that. And then one of those kind of moves. Oh, I just got a Skype message. Oh, I got another Skype message. Um, this might actually be important, so I'll be back in a second uh, after I get a little bit back. I'm gonna go see what it is, because if it's what I think it is, then I will. Yeah, I'll just be back in a second. Let's sit down here. Back to Obscuro City. Because hopefully Joltik can take out some of the lower uh, level Zubats with his Electro Web. I'm actually kind of reaching here with his 38. Uh, super Smear. I'm so used to like the gym. Like when I saw Super Sonic, I was like, oh wait, he's not allowed to use that. Oh wait, this isn't the gym. Because if you don't know, in the gym, you're not allowed to use uh, status moves like that. Okay. So, yeah, I just, I'm, I'm like in that mindset now that. I gotta like type slash end battle and tell him he's disqualified. I don't want to battle you though. There we go. I'm kind of sad that I don't have slash end battle anymore though. I'm gonna miss that. I am. Yeah, let's just use Electro Web again. Yeah, that's right. You missed that stupid supersonic, stupid Zubat. Freaking hate oh, supersonic and other moves like that. Miss again. Oh, yeah. You didn't even touch me. Suck it! Let's battle some of these guys. Jolting is already uber strong. He's already taken down level. I don't even know what level that was. Actually, he did get hit on me, I just realized. That's my bad. <laughs> he only took down 70 feet. Whoa, what the heck just happened? I don't know why I made that noise. But, okay. Oh, man. He's not even getting any XP. Oh, I might. Uh, let me tell this guy no thanks. Um, yeah, I, I think I'm just gonna put an EXP share on it, actually. I don't know, I kinda want to. Uh, yeah, I got one of these right here, so I'll just slap one of these bad boys on him, and then so I can just battle like level 50s. Oops. Pokey heal you up, even though I don't even think you're damaged. Nah, I got one. It actually took me a while to find the uh, or the Joltik that I was looking for, but then uh, I finally got one from, let's see what his name was, Nick, I don't even know how to pronounce Neko Ramen, I don't know how it's pronounced, Nik Nikor Ramen, I don't even know, I don't know, I do not know. Oh, let me just message this guy, this guy messages me all the time, are you recording, are you recording? Yes. Smiley face. <laughs> Um, okay, I'm gonna take on this level 48 because I think I can take him. Unless he's already in a battle. Nope, I got him. Uh, Ice Beam you down out of the sky! 24, okay. Okay, I'll take it. He's getting up there. He is getting up the levels. Even though he's only gotten one since I got him, but still. Yeah, mostly it's gonna be Starmie and Joltik in this next gym. Well, actually. Wait, yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna be able to evolve him before the next gym too because he evolves. 
because of that YouTube. Um, yeah, he evolves at like level 36, I think. So I'm gonna be able to, I'm gonna be able to get him for the next gym to evolve. So he's just gonna be outspeeding everybody, just thunderbolting everybody out of the sky. Stupid birdies. I actually find the flying gym the easiest out of uh, the gyms in like most Pokemon games too. I don't know why. I just feel like they have so many weaknesses because they're like ice, electric, rock. Blue boss, I'm going for it. No one else see that. Please, 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 no one else see that. Do not force battle me. I'm not in the mood. Yes. Yes, blue boss. No, I can't kill it. Yeah. No, battle. Yes. Got him. But, uh, I don't even remember what I was saying. Uh, I got Razor Fang, Cycle and Wise Fang. Okay, that's not that good, but whatever. I just put all this in my inventory just because I can see seem all cluttered. Um, but yeah, I always do well against the farm gym because they have so many weaknesses. And I just find that the easiest gym usually out of all, like in every Pokemon game. I don't know why. Oh, also, in case you didn't hear and you play Pokemon, like the actual game, not just Pixelmon, or you just care about this at all. They announced today that the next Pokemon game is going to be a remake of Generation 3, which I am so excited about because that is my favorite generation of Pokemon out of all of them. That was my first game, and in case you don't know what Gen 3 is, it's Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald, the ones where the starters are Mudkip, Torchic, and uh, Trico. So that's the remake of that for the uh, next game. So I'm so excited for that. I don't know, like Sapphire was my first Pokemon game, and literally I played that for hours on my. Uh, well, I think it was my Game Boy SP Color. I think I think it was what it was called. I don't even remember the full name of it, but it was like the first Game Boy that like flipped, and it had like the little, it had like the flipping screen up. Um. But yeah, I I just love that game so much. I've probably beaten, like, between, like, Ruby, Emerald, and Sapphire, I've probably beaten those games at least 15 times. I mean, that may sound like a lot, and you would think you'd get bored, but I just love those games so much. The only problem is, it's coming out on the 3DS, and I don't have a 3DS. So, <laughs> I'm either going to have to buy one, or I'm going to have to find someone that, that will lend me theirs, at, like, if they buy the game. And I have a friend who I know has a 3DS. He bought one just for the latest games. Uh, what was it called? I didn't play the latest games. Uh, X and Y, that's what they are. Yeah, X and Y. Uh, he bought it just to play X and Y. So, I'm pretty sure he's going to be buying the next one, because I think... Uh, generation 3 was his favorite generation 2, so he, I know, I'm probably, he's probably gonna buy it, so I'll just lend, uh, or I'll just ask him to lend me his. I mean, he probably will, but I might have to beg a little bit, but hopefully not. And my arm is falling asleep because of the position I'm sitting. I really have no, like, special setup that I have for, like, playing. Uh, Minecraft, like, I, I don't even know how to explain it, like, I just don't have a set setup. I either play on the floor, or on my bed, like, right now I'm just playing on the floor, because I don't really have a desk or anything to play on, and there's not really any other comfortable position to play besides this that I can stay in for long periods of time, so I'm just laying on the floor right now, just casually laying in the middle of the floor. But, yeah, I'm moving soon, so I will probably be getting a desk when I do move, which is I don't really have any room in my room right now, but I'll be getting a desk when I move probably, so then I'll have like an actual area to record, and that's going to be awesome, because it's going to be so much more comfortable, and just, I can just relax. So yeah, that's, that's going to be epic. Joe Pixar is level 27, nice. I'm probably going to end up training him a little bit off camera just because I don't want to have too many episodes where it's just me training. So I might do like one more episode of me training and then after that I might just do all of the rest of my training off camera and then we'll just be ready to fight the flying gym. But I don't want to, I'm also like hesitant to do that just because the flying gym is not even open yet. So I don't want to like do all my training off camera and then I just don't have anything to do because I leveled up all my guys, and I can't even face the flying gym, so I'll figure something out. I'll definitely figure something out. And uh, also, 
I want you guys to leave uh, recommendations in the comments for what else you want to see me do because my schedule right now is I post Pixelmon every day of the week except Wednesday. I do a mini game and then on Saturday and Sunday I do double uploads where I have a Pixelmon video and then later that day I upload a mini game too. And I feel like uploading more often is just better overall for YouTube. But I feel like you guys don't enjoy the mini games as much. So, I mean. I'll still probably do mini games like every now and then, but if you want to see me do like another channel, like an, uh, not another channel, another series on my channel, that's what I meant to say. I can't even English right now. If you want to see me do like another series on my channel, like another like let's play, be it just like a normal vanilla Minecraft let's play, or like another mod or something, I can do that if you guys just want me to. Just leave recommendations of what you want me to do down below, and if like people agree and like that comment gets liked a lot, then I'll consider doing that. So yeah, I just I I want you guys to like everything that I'm putting up because I know a lot of people just watch me for my Pixelmon Let's Play, and that's fine. But I just want to I just want to post what you guys want. So I mean, if you guys don't want me to post any games as often, as often I won't, and I'll I'll post whatever you guys want me to on Minecraft. I don't know about other games though, because I might expand to other games once my channel grows a little bit more, but for now I'm just going to stick with Minecraft. My friend told me that he th thinks I should ex expand to like other games, and I, ooh, nice, Electro Ball. And I want to, but I'm also kind of hesitant because I don't know if it's going to do well on my channel, but yeah. Like, I just downloaded Steam, so, I mean, I could look for some, like, fun games on there that I could play. But I don't know, whatever, whatever you guys want me to do. Whatever. You know, just go with the flow, why not? But, uh, yeah, so just leave in the comments what other kind of series, or let's plays, or just whatever you want to see on my channel in Minecraft. So, yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of rambling now, I'm just, I'm sorry I'm talking fast, I just have a lot to say, and so, like, little time to do it. Yeah, I don't know. But I think I'm going to end this episode off here just because uh, my headache is intensifying a lot and I really need to go take some ibuprofen or something. So I'm going to go do that and you guys just have a great day. See you guys. Okay guys, so I know this is like after I already said goodbye, but so I just, I'm, I was just on here chilling, you know, chilling out. And I was just training up my uh, tournament team and stuff, and so I just came across a uh, something something really special while I was walking along the plains. Ba bam! Shiny drift bloom. <laughs> I still don't even know like how. Oh, it looks so cool. It's like golden. I love it. It's so pretty. So pretty. So I'm just gonna master ball this thing right away because I'm not even gonna risk like even killing it so I'm just gonna master bolt straight off the bat there and so I'm gonna tell you guys I in the beginning when I was first starting this let's play I was going to use your flim and then I decided that I would, since I already had star you it was where star me seems that was part psychic type sorry if I can't talk it's like 2 30 in the morning so I can't even talk right now I'm so tired but anyway so I was going to use him, and then I decided I didn't need another ghost type because I already had Starmie who could learn Shadow Ball and stuff. And so I decided that I wasn't going to use him, I was going to go with like a dragon flying type like Salamence instead. But I actually am going to use him now because, I mean, it's shiny, how can I not use it? <laughs> like, I'm still just so excited, I did not expect to find a shiny. And that's the first wild shiny that I've ever found before. And I've played this mod probably for total, I'd say, about two, maybe like 200 hours total. And that's the first shiny, maybe more, I don't know, I don't know. Like seriously, I have no friends. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Um, I, and that's the first shiny I've ever found. And I'm still just like amazed and I'm glad it's something so special. So let's go back to spawn and we'll take it out of the PC really quickly and look at stats and its moving stuff. 
Yeah, Driftmoon is actually really good because it's really fast and it also um, has like really good attack and since it's part ghost and part flying it has like amazing typing advantages and stuff and can learn like, a lot of different moves so I'm really excited about that. I mean it's horrible moves right now but we'll teach it some good ones like Shadow Ball and stuff like that. So it's got Spit Up, Hex, Stockpile, and Focus Energy. Now that's pretty awful, but yeah, so, and then Hardy Nature, that's a bad nature for Drift Point, but I really don't care because it's shiny. Um, yeah, I think that, I th I'm not even sure what that does, but, uh, what does it do? I think it increases attack and like, lowers special defense or something, I don't know. But yeah, I'm pretty sure it increases attack and he's more of a special attack, as you can see. But yeah, anyway, I'm really excited that I caught this, because that's like one of the prettiest shinies ever. Like, look how awesome that- oh, my disk space is about to be full. I'm gonna wrap this up really quickly. So yeah, um, I'm just really excited. So, uh, yeah, peace guys.